Hi again, welcome to NetView CCTV. Uh, I'm uh, for this exercise. I'm going to install some hard drives in a Hikvision DS seven seven one six NI dash E four forward slash sixteen P. That's the seven seven one six NI uh, sixteen channel with sixteen PoE ports NVR Hikvision NVR. Um, I'm going to be putting uh, two. Three terabyte hard drives inside uh, to give it a six terabyte uh, recording capability. And two devices of proper drives uh, inside the 7716. And here it is. It's quite a substantial machine. So let's have a look inside. Couple of screws. Take the cover off. Cover should just slide off with just the two screws. There we go. Let's have a quick look inside. So what have we got inside? We've got the motherboard. The motherboard there, one, two, three, four SATA connectors. Uh, three, four, one of them is occupied with a DVD uh, writer, which can be removed uh, for additional drives. The power leads uh, for the SATA connectors for the hard drives. Just there, SATA power leads and uh, uh, extra power power connectors for hard drives. Currently, there's a space in here for two hard drives, one using these two holes, and the second one will go just there using them to screw holes. Uh, fit inside, power connectors will connect the hard drives up for the power, and we'll be adding SATA port uh, connector leads from these ports into each of the hard drives. There we go. So we're going to open up be careful with the hard drives. Try not to touch the underneath. Three terabytes. The second one. Look into our box of goodies that came with the NVR. The first thing we're going to need is the screws to connect the hard drives into. We'll put this aside for a moment. Hard drive screws are the silver ones. There. So, first hard drive will fit in there. Next one next to it. Connectors both facing towards the motherboard. We can connect the power and the SATA connectors up. Um, I find it easier to push uh, the power and the SATA connectors in first. Find there, so we can actually go secure connector. Oh, that was going to reach. Fine. Clip on top, push it in. Now 
Right. Put one screw in with a guide. You can't see this, but uh, I can just see the screw hole underneath the hard drive, which I'm going to get a couple of threads on and then use a screwdriver to tighten it up a little bit. Got my first screw in there. Align the other holes up. There we go. loosely first. Once they're all in and secure, then you can tighten them up. There you go. One hard drive installed. Uh, cable tidy. That is not going to be long enough. For that one, I'm going to use the longer one that was inside the package. So they got the same thing. There we go. There you go, that's one hard drive installed, power and your SATA connector. Next hard drive, exactly the same thing. Which will go next to it. Just align the holes up. You can see I'm aligning the holes up. Get a couple of threads on. By hand. Forget when you finish to completely tighten all these screws up and make sure it's quite secure. Same thing, power connector, the power and the stuffer. There we go. Clicks in. There we go. And we have hard drive installed. Tidy the cables up a bit, which I'll do in a minute. And 
we have two hard drives installed. Uh, I hope that's that helped.